Welcome to part four of Let's Play Game Dev Tycoon on the Portal of Awesome. I'm McGunn, this is POA Games. Let's do part four. Here we are in our lovely garage. We just researched superhero games. We have Last Tale, a fantasy RPG on the NES. Still doing some sales a little bit. Um, let's make a new game. And now we can pick our target audience, so let's target those youngins and steal their parents' money because they cannot resist but to play our superhero action game on the NES, which uses our basic game engine, and it is called, uh, what is it called? It is called Heroes. Very simple. All the kids will know just what it means. Ooh, almost 300,000 in sales from Last Tale. That's pretty good. It's not quite uh, the Final Fantasy ripoff that I wanted it to be, though. Action game. We will focus less on stories and quests, a little more on engine, quite a lot on gameplay, and bada boom! Alright. Off to a bit of a shaky start, I think, here. Scratching his head, doesn't know what to do. Okay. Okay. Well, superheroes need a little bit of dialogue, but they especially need artificial intelligence and level design. So let's try that. Okay, it's looking alright. Mind you, the design and technology points don't really determine how good the game is going to be. Going to be, you could have low amounts of points, and someone could rate it all tens, and then all of a sudden you have a hit. Uh, and that is more determined on luck and your time allocation that you give to it. Alright. That looks about good to me. Uh oh. The Master System by Sega, because I'm not using these stupid fake names that they do in the game, is released, so that's not too good of a thing for our NES game that we're making. But, the NES is way better, so shouldn't be a big problem. Alright, this is looking pretty good. I wouldn't mind having a little more technology on an action game, though, but... Uh -huh. So, the Master System will flourish in parts of the world that aren't North America. Okay, new topic, new, topic, new combo, great combo, new records, leveling up, release it. Here we go. Hit. Just like I said before. I called it, didn't I? Hit. Here we go. Hit time. Ten. Six? Oh. No. This is not what I was hoping for. Climb to a nine and I'll be happy. Oh. Jeez. What does that equal out to? 6.75 Not the hope I was hoping for, but we targeted it to young people so it might still do really good in sales In fact, yeah, it is. It's doing really good in sales. Targeting it to youngins was a good idea It's time to do some research. We've been making a lot of games Got the steering wheel going on. I think now that the uh, Master System is out competing with the NES that will bring the PC and Commodore market shares up higher because you have two consoles that are battling against each other now. Okay, got the steering wheel. Let's get that joystick. Oh, Heroes is still selling. Doing pretty good. Oh, new research casual games that we can make now. I'm not going to worry about that for now, though, because kids want hard games, I think, at this point. They want games that are going to kick their ass. Oh, I could get a mouse, though. Let's get a mouse and make a nice PC game. Let's try that out. I know what kind of game I want to make. You just wait and see. Okay. Commodore 64 is not doing good anymore. That's good because I want to make a nice PC game. 
perfect timing. Is there anything else I can research right now? Not that I need, because it's time to make a new engine. Okay, I forgot the name of the first one, so this will be the Mega Engine. Mega Engine! We'll give it mouse support, joystick support, steering wheel support, but a boom. The Mega Engine! This is gonna be amazing. Come on. It's all about those hit games. I'm a little disappointed we haven't made a hit yet, but it will happen. And when we make a hit, we will hopefully have enough money to move out of this shitty garage and into a nice office. Oh, the Game Boy. The Game Boy. This is looking good because we're going to be able to make some nice cheap Game Boy games and so many kids are going to have that. It will be good. It will be very good. But hopefully before it's released we can get this PC game I want to make up. This PC game developed on the Mega Engine. Your new game engine, Mega Engine, is now complete. Okay. Let's make a new game. Making it on that PC. Ooh, the PC is still not very good market share. Well, it's not bad. It's pretty balanced right now. Develop that. For everyone, the game will be a military strategy game. And it will be on our new Mega Engine. And it will be called Mila Tactics. Mila Tactics. Alright. Good graphics. Alright, so we're gonna need some crazy engine. And you know what? For a tactics game, we'll go a little bit more than the average bear would on story. Um. We need mouse support. This is definitely a mouse game. Alright, it's looking good. Okay, the game link's released, so that's what we're gonna do next, is make one of those. So long as this game doesn't bankrupt us. Crazy artificial intelligence on this. I want this to be one of those games that people just can't believe how smart the computer is when they're going against them. Okay. Nice graphics. Pretty good world design. Some nice sound. Do it. Alright, fixing those bugs. No extra points. Let's do it. Bam! New technology record. I'm not sure how important technology is for a strategy game, but we'll see. We will see. New researchers, level editor, better AI, marketing. All very important. So, let's start working on that while our new game is about to be reviewed. I think this strategy game is going to do well. So, let's research better AI. Just so that in the future we can make a better strategy game. Okay, here we go. Review. Ouch. Eight, okay. Seven. And a six. Quirky, but good. Nah, fuck you. Alright. Well, I think it is time to end this video. So that's the end of part four. Stay tuned for part five. Oh, research better AI. Part five is coming, and I swear to you, we have a hit just waiting to happen. We're going to make a nice hit on the Game Boy. We're going to start banking that Skrilla for real this time. So I'll see you guys next time.